Hello and welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today we're going to test out the new setup on WRC Generations with the Subaru and Colin McRae. So if you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe and let's go. This new setup, man, is so freaking incredible. Yeah, man, the resi just having it stable. My gosh, my gosh. Because now you can. Now I can feel everything a lot better. Whew. So much nicer. Now we are playing on the Xbox Series X version. Uh, WRC Generations. This is the long stage in uh, on um, New Zealand. This is like one of my favorite stages. I really like. I really like the way this one looks. This this is a nice nice stage. I like the way the dirt slides on this. Oh my gosh, this just this just feels a lot better. Woo boy, this FGT is such a freaking beast. So smooth, man. Now I gotta have to play some more. Oh no, I'm gonna have to play some more, but. This is uh I've only I've only I've only done a couple couple uh rallies so far on this new setup. But my gosh, man, like I'm already uh I'm already feeling the extreme difference from that play seat, man. Ooh. Ooh. Man, like I feel like I'm gonna be able to get really, really good at this. I've noticed, I noticed, I noticed immediately with games like, um, games like Set of Course of Competizione and all the other ones, my my lap times are getting much better, a lot faster, oh, because of how how much better the stability on this feels, like being able to just do. Like the the steering, it, it it's a little bit different. That's why that's why I feel like I'm messing up a little bit because the steering now feels a lot more. I'm still I'm I'm trying to get used to how it feels when I'm sliding, so that I so that I know when I'm sliding and when I'm when I'm actually just you know the momentum. Dirt Rally feels freaking incredible on here. Oh, yeah, see, like I'm sliding a bit too much now because I'm I'm going into things a little more differently. But this is freaking great. See, I'm, I'm trying to figure out, you know, am I sliding right now? Am I am I on the wheels? But this is great, man. I'm going to have a lot of fun playing this nowadays this is so fun <laughs> man yeah if i could just figure out if i could just figure out i think i think it might just be my settings um on the wheel i've got to change a little bit because i'm not i'm not feeling the slide as much Cause I'm not, I'm not being able to feel when I, when I'm at the, when I'm at the point. So it's going to take a, just a second to like figure that out, but whoa, I'll tell you what, man, just having, just having it stable. Like on, on, when I'm on the, when I'm on the tar, see, this is the like dirt. This is like a, um, gravel stage, but when I'm on tarmac, oh boy, it's, it's, it's freaking nice. It is, it is very nice, but I want to practice on the, on the, 
on the gravel the most because that one there you can get like the nice little slides going and uh that to me is that's fun so a lot of my, my a lot of my favorite stages on this game are the are the are the gravel stages see look at that man my gosh yes this this is beautiful Being able to slide up here. See, like on the tarmac, it feels a, a, a lot better. Like a lot more, like a lot smoother. Like you have more more control. So it's just a it's just a thing of I, maybe I need to set my, maybe I need to set the settings up just a little bit differently so that I can feel like the, the slide when I'm sliding through the dirt as opposed to driving. Woo, man, this is, this is, this is pretty exciting. This is pretty exciting. Ooh. being able to catch that stuff man it's so exciting like i mean you could just see just from the the beginning of this run that i'm already instantly getting better with my movement and stuff as i'm starting to it's starting to click better, and I'm starting to learn this car. This is so incredible. I've never felt like I've had this much control on any of these any of these games. Yeah. Now this is a different type of dirt and it does have different properties through here. I think this one's a little bit thicker. Nice. Dude, this is so awesome. Whoa, we're going way out. This dirt here is a little bit more slippery than the uh than the uh than the than the gray dirt tan dirt is slippery more slippery just i just i think it's like heavier gravel or something oh woo. yeah man this is so great Oh boy. Yeah. This is this is this is um definitely a much better experience because now I can actually add some uh some uh, more heavier force feedback to the wheel. And that does kind of help on these dirt stages. On these. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Coming in on that one a little bit hot, man. I'm starting to understand the slide on this now. Starting to understand how it feels.
maybe not great, but. See, I was getting more grip right there than I was than I was getting slide. That is so important to know too, because oh no. Oh man, I hate messing up a lot and then So uh, the, the new WRC cars in here are kind of a pain in the butt <clears throat> because I don't think they have any cr cr uh, throttle control. So it was just uh, every time I'd try to get the wheel out for that, they would just feel weird. Should probably do some like some slow laps. I don't know, some, some slow... Yeah, so that, like, the, the sliding and stuff is feeling. But being able to get on that, feel the momentum of the car and stuff. I still feel like this game here has really good body roll, and that's what kind of helps. Could have been out there a little more. It's all right, though. Ooh. Dude, I couldn't even imagine trying to play this at 30 frames a second. Sorry I picked the long one, guys, but that's the only way to, like, really get a good feel for your car without having to start and stop and start and stop and get a, you know, like, really, get to really push things and learn how the car, car maneuvers over a longer course than, than you do on them short ones. Whoa, no, we're going off. Oh, I tried. <clears throat> And I'm not really using the e-brake. I need to buy I'm gonna buy one. I've got a this this cockpit came with a with a, a shifter mount, so I'm gonna get the e-brake for it. And so I can uh yeah. So I can use that because it is really hard to try to push a button on the steering wheel and do that. So yeah, I think I will buy the the e brake attachment or uh, the e brake for for the Thrustmaster. Oh, man. Yeah, like picking this car to do this for the first one, you know. Gosh dang, man, come on. And then like getting to <laughs> getting to know it. I mean, I got my tires probably freaking burnt up right now. <clears throat> so now it's starting to slide a lot more than than it was. We're almost to the end of the stage. Gotta learn, gotta learn it all, though. 
got to actually freaking learn how to control your car once the tires are starting to wear out too. Yeah, see, I'm sliding a lot farther now. I even hit I even hit the e-brake on that one and I still couldn't freaking still couldn't pull that one together. Couldn't get back on the wheel fast enough for that one. Oh. Maybe next one I'll do like a, I'll, I'll do one where I'm not like really trying to push it too hard because my tires are junk now. I, can, I can't even freaking stop at the e-brake. I like that was a weird slide. Dang. Wasn't even going that fast. I should have been able to freaking cut. <laughs> Easy, man. Come on, car. Don't fall off the thing. Come on, get some throttle on there. Don't fall off. Oh, no. Come on, we can get it. We can we can get it across the finish line. Come on, buddy. Yeah, dude, my tires are obviously junk. Literally just slid right off that freaking edge. That's fine. I'm trying not to, buddy. Oh my gosh, those fences drive me nuts sometimes. Ooh, this is this is an interesting freaking experience. I'll tell you what, these WRC games, man, they're so fun, but they're so they're so touchy sometimes that it, you you try to you just take what you can. So, all right, man, there you go. <laughs> Sorry about all the crashing, but if you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.